A Valdez woman arrested early yesterday morning faces drug charges on warrants from two separate years. She was placed in the Burke County Jail following her arrest and remained in jail as of earlier today. A court date is scheduled later this month. 29-year-old Harley Nicole Smith of Ivory Pass in Valdez was arrested yesterday by Morganton Public Safety officers. She's charged with two felony counts of possession of Schedule II controlled substance, along with a misdemeanor count of failure to pay monies. One of the drug charges is on a warrant from 2023. The other is from this year. Smith was arrested shortly before 1 a.m. yesterday and placed in the Burke County Jail under $8,070 total bond. She remained in jail as of earlier today. A first court appearance was scheduled Thursday. Her next district court date is set for March 25th. 41-year-old Todd Andrew Williams of Williams Loop in Morganton was arrested yesterday by Morganton Public Safety Officers. He's charged with felony possession of Schedule I controlled substance, along with a count of driving during revocation. Williams was arrested shortly before 1 a.m. Thursday and was initially placed in the Burke County Jail under a 48-hour hold or until a judge became available. He remained in jail as of earlier today. Bond has been set at $5,500. A first court appearance was scheduled yesterday. The next district court date for Williams is scheduled for March 25th. 35-year-old Kayla Marie Wisnant of Carbon City Road in Morganton was arrested Monday, also by Morganton Public Safety. She's charged with felony possession of Schedule II controlled substance. Following the arrest, Wisnant was placed in the Burke County Jail without bond. She was not listed as an inmate here in Burke County as of earlier today. A district court appearance is scheduled for next Thursday, March 21st in Morganton. Reporting from Burke County, I'm Rob Eastwood, WHKY News.